This is a thing. This is a thing. This is also a thing. This is what I'm working with. Hello, and welcome to the channel. I'm your host, Anthazara, but y'all can just call me Anthe. <laughs> it's been a bit of a hectic day. Zelda woke me up at 5 a.m. in the morning because she had to pee suddenly, and because she had a bit of a bile throw up for some reason. Sometimes that happens with her, yet, you know, she had a good dinner last night, so I don't know why that happens sometimes, but Luna, it's happened to Luna. They say it happens to smaller dogs, so I just take care of her and give her a little treat, and she's good to go. But then she woke me up a couple hours later <laughs> because she had to pee again. <sighs> so I'm a little sleepy tired today. <laughs> Yet functional in the sleepiness. I don't get it. Then the groceries came at a little bit after 11 and then we had to get some furniture because my dad's office chair broke. <laughs> like it's really bad broke. <laughs> had to immediately buy a new chair as quickly as possible. And in the process, I ended up getting two shelves and a half for me. So I have a shelf or two or three to build now. So we might end up doing that on camera at some point. <laughs> now I'm just doing some cooking because I'm hungry and I would like some food. But the only food I want is Alfredo pasta. So that's what I'm doing, except I had this brilliant idea. Let me show you. So I decided to put mushrooms in the Alfredo sauce that I'm going to make. Probably a small pan to cook pasta in, but you know, it'll do. I'm just sitting here with my bowl of pasta and mushrooms. Man, it's good. Oh, wow. It's easier to make than the <laughs> than the lasagna casserole, that's for sure. <laughs> I have things that I need to do, but you know. But am I gonna do them? That's the real question now, isn't it? <laughs> I could really do the dishes, couldn't I? I could really have a shower, couldn't I? Am I gonna do any of them? I mean, maybe? Let's go see my shelves though. I'm not gonna put them up yet because I'm tired and sleepy. <laughs> but let's go see my shelves. I will show them off. I have 15 boxes in the living room that need to be unpacked. So this is the disaster that are all these boxes. Whenever I try to look for something, <laughs> they go all over the place. But yes, I've got so many books. The chair looks like it's in fine condition, besides dad chewing on it like a dribble. I'm kidding, I'm kidding, he doesn't. It's kind of broken. This is my mini bookshelf. We got them from Big Lots. And then I got two of these. So I'm trying to figure something out. It's a little difficult. <laughs> um, so I've been kind of keeping this a secret, but... I'm planning to do some rearranging with my room and my office. So yeah, I haven't told my dad, I haven't told my closest friends. So yeah, I'm, I'm thinking of moving rooms. The only problem is it's still pretty small. <laughs> but now that I've got the shelves, I'm trying to figure out what I'm going to do with them. All right, I am in Sims 4 trying to design this tiny, tiny bedroom that I have down in the basement. Now, I didn't go downstairs to go check on some things like I should have checked, you know, how high one part of the wall is and there's no door to the bedroom. So that was unnecessary as well. But if you look where the bed is right now, that wall has this weird overhang. And so I wasn't sure if the shelves could fit against that wall and so I am just struggling and struggling trying to figure out where I would want something and I would also like to have a TV on the wall where my bed is facing that would be ideal and nice but I can't do you know I can't fit an end table and a shelf and another shelf in all of that space so I was struggling so then I decided we're gonna go measure I, uh, I left my, 
I left my stand upstairs, so we're just gonna have to make do with hand, one-handedness. So the shelves are 72 inches tall, all right? Now, so here's the problem with my basement, with a basement room. Hear my thought process. <laughs> so this room was supposed to be my office because it's the nicer room and it's the prettier room. And I figured, hey, I will spend more time in my office than I would my bedroom. That was a lie. <laughs> but here's the trouble with these basement rooms is for some reason, someone thought it was a good idea to do this. And so you can see, this, this is just too tall. <laughs> I don't know why this is a thing, but oh yeah, well here we go. Here's a shelf tour. <laughs> All of my manga and <sighs> manga from Japan. <laughs> oh yeah, I got a lot of volumes where at the time you couldn't get them in English, so these you can get in English now, which you know, they're better in Japanese anyway. And these, I'm missing volume three and four of these. But yeah, anyway, I'm distracted. Oh my gosh. In the bedroom that I'm sleeping, this is a thing. This, this is a thing. This is also a thing. And you know, I've been fine with it. I, I was fine with it. Except I was getting sick from the heater. It's actually cold in my room right now. I was getting sick from the heater because it's right above my bed. So yeah, I'm sorry, I'm not giving you the waste look because I'm sorry, it's a disaster and I, I can't. And then there's an exposed pipe which I covered with a pillow so it wouldn't burst any pipes since I leave my window open. <laughs> this is what I'm working with. Hang out on the shelf. Alright, you're on my shelf. <laughs> but from from the floor to the ceiling, from this wannabe half ceiling, it's 81 inches, so 83 inches. Which means I can put the shelves on this side of the wall if I wanted to. That's kind of exciting. I haven't told anyone this. The first time anyone's gonna hear this is from this video. I love you. Yes, I am switching rooms. <laughs> My aunt will be very excited. <laughs> All right, I come back into The Sims 4 to try to design the room. This time I leave the door off. <laughs> but yeah, so it looks like this design will work the best for my area and it feels less crowded in this way so I'm kind of excited if I can get it to look like this I hope it'll look good in real life so if I put the two shelves here and then some kind of TV there it looks like someone already had something bolted to the wall at the very least guess we'll see piece of furniture there and then I put my bed here. I kind of was hoping that the bed would be here this whole time. Simply because I love being by the window. <laughs> so yeah, I'm kind of glad how that turned out. I just need to get rid of all of this junk out of this room and put it in another room where there is no room. This though, I don't know what I'm gonna do with that. I guess we'll find out. <laughs> I guess we will find out what I will do with this thing. It's really beautiful, it's lovely. We'll see, we'll see where it goes. This will be my new room. You can tell when I'm looking for something that I'm just haphazardly <laughs> hoping for the best to find it. Oh yeah, and like eight boxes of yarn at least. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. Stay tuned for part two when I completely actually do this. I'm a little nervous. <laughs> I don't know if I'm gonna do it tomorrow, but I'm thinking maybe I will. So we'll see. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you give this video a like and subscribe to the channel. I'm making Vlogmas videos all month long. Until tomorrow, bye.